Okay, how'd you put the key in? We don't know what we're doing. <laughs> that was the first night. We didn't film it. Cute Elsa's baby. Oh, I hope you're too cute. I should probably shouldn't film small random children. Probably not advisable. Back, Is that not an okay observation to make? Yeah, that's it. Guess who's text, baby? <laughs> And in short, only at the cost of an arm, two legs, and three children. <laughs> so we're officially good to go, ladies and gentlemen. We're a little bit of a mess, as you might be able to tell. So we're just trying to get organised. See you when we leave, probs. I'm a motherfucking driver, bitch! Wait, how did you put the key in? <laughs> oh, wait, it's okay, I've done it, guys. Um, we haven't actually even made it off the drive yet. <laughs> the Mini, our Mini, is here. We can't get the van past it because the turn is so narrow at the end of the drive. So Asaya's just gone to get the keys for the Mini. It's so... <laughs> you just scared me. It's so scary driving this. <laughs> okay, we're actually off. I feel like I don't know where I am in my lane. We've made it to a garage that was said online that it did LPG because what we want to do right now is fill up with gas to go back to the drive, the dreaded drive, <laughs> and see if our gas setup works because we haven't been able to test it yet because we haven't been able to get it on the road to fill up with gas. So yeah, we specifically googled garages that have LPG fill-ups and... One second. We don't know what we're doing. <laughs> it was jammed. We had to use the other key and properly twist it. But we've got it off. And they don't do LPG here. I can't remember if I said that. I feel so discombobulated. Like, it's 6 p.m. or something. 10 past 6, but to me it feels like 10 a.m. Like, I've not really eaten. Since we got the tax three, which happened this morning, it's just been like, find insurance, find insurance, and that's taken us hours, but it feels like nothing else has happened, like it should still be morning. So I feel very confused about the fact that it's 10 past six. Like when I just looked at my phone before, I was like, what? How? We were planning to sleep somewhere not on the drive tonight. We have so much stuff still to, that we need to get organized, like testing the gas. Oh, but at least we're on the road, baby. We're in our second garage. Still no sign of LPG. He's gone in to ask again. No. He's saying no. Well, this isn't good. Don't do it here, Eva. <laughs> <laughs> Update. We are at our third services. Um, yeah, this is turning out to be quite the journey. <laughs> and also we can't seem to find it here either. He's just gone in to ask again. Don't do it at Lynch Services anymore. Are you joking? No. Back and we don't have any gas. Lim Services don't do it either. So we're just shelving that idea until tomorrow. What are we doing now? We need to pump up the tires. Dad's gonna help us with that and just organize what we've got left in the house before we drive off and find somewhere random to sleep tonight. <laughs> tune in. I mean, don't tune in, stay tuned to find out where that is. <laughs> tune in as well, <laughs> if you've not been tuning in. Hi friends. It's a lot later in the evening. I'm absolutely knackered. Energy is at a rock bottom. Just yep. updating the folks. <laughs> but we've decided to go somewhere for the night 
<laughs> go park somewhere for the night. So the plan is we've gone on park for night. We just want to find somewhere close by because we've still got stuff that we need to sort out the house that we haven't managed to do yet because we're just knackered. It's like 20 minutes down the road. It's by a park. So the plan is to drive there stay there for the night in the morning get up early walk out at that park just for like a new experience because we've been trapped at this on the drive waiting to have our vehicle tax that we could move it <laughs> so we want to move it so yeah we're going to walk out in a different park which will be nice then come back sort out the stuff at the house and then actually go which will be amazing but this is amazing anyway we're well excited well, Pooch is here wondering what's going on. To be fair, this has been a great transition for us because we've been living in the van on the drive. So she's had the like getting used to the van, but in a familiar place. <laughs> Don't mind all the sounds behind us. So, that was the first night. We didn't film it. Good morning. We're back on the drive. <laughs> we came back after last night because we had stuff we wanted to sort out, but I think I explained we didn't want to stay on the drive. But look at the absolute chaos that is the van right now after driving in it. Everything is everywhere. So we haven't learned how to like batten down the hatches yet. I mean, to be honest, we didn't try that much because there's just, everything doesn't have a place yet. We just kind of threw everything in and left. <laughs> so now I'm gonna organize the van. Asaya's organizing the garage. I've already tidied my bedroom, sorted that out, had a bath, feeling more refreshed. We're both feeling very exhausted. There's a lot of emotions running through us both because this is it now, like this is the big change scary and there's so much to do but just how scary it is drains you so we're both like flagging but pushing through it's also really exciting but it's terrifying it's gonna be great i feel like actually afterwards i'm gonna feel really good that it's all organized this is coming off here as well which is really getting to me everything's just kind of falling apart look this drawer fell Thing fell off there. Oh no, the memory card's running out. I'm going to have to go. Bye. Hello there. Hello there. And welcome back to another video on Chufty Cheese. So we've not got any actual content for you yet. Um, <laughs> night two in the van. Stayed at a sick place. We should have reviewed it to be honest. Sycamore in High Peak. Recommend it. It's just such yeah. a lovely staff. A lovely staff. Amazing. It's probably the best pub I've ever been to. Oh my lordy lord. And I have to say, that is looking cute else, isn't it? Oh, uh, you're too cute. These views, folks. Bit of a miserable, bit of a grey day. It's raining all night. But it's not miserable, it's a joyous day. It's a joyous grey day. What's this red thing in the field? Kind of litter. 16 degree decline, right. Yeah, I feel like you're gonna fall off the seat, don't you? It's downhill. Hey, the chick. Yeah, we're on the way to, to a shop to get brekkie, and then we're gonna see my brother and his new baby. His new babies, new twins. His new Can't we? To meet them. Elsa, my love, be quiet. <laughs> We finally found gas! We've come all the way to Leek. Wherever the hell Leek is. This is the first time we're doing it, so just trying to figure it out. Good girl, quiet. Good girl, quiet. Uh, uh, quiet, quiet. Success? No, I'm gonna um, go get some of these chores. I think that's a great idea. It says, if in doubt, please ask for assistance. Oh my golly gosh, it's cold. Close us in, Elsa. Close us in. Look, she's over there now. I don't think she loves being in the van when we're moving. 
think she'll get used to it. And like obviously we're moving and things are rattling around and then there's a loud noise. She gets a bit scared. So yeah, we've come, we've been in the van a few days now. Um, we've come to Leek on the way to, where are we going? It's near Alton Towers but we're not going to Alton Towers. We found a place on Park for Night that looks so nice, like really good views. So we're gonna drive to there, but en route, we've come to this gas filling place to finally get gas so we could shower and have warm water and I can wash my face and stuff because I've not been doing it because it's been cold. Oh, he's back. He's back and he's on his own. No one coming? No. What did they say? They don't want to work it. <laughs> and hold button. Else, be quiet. We're just filling with gas. It's too dangerous for you to come out. So the people at work here don't know how to use this despite. So no assistance has been given. We've managed to figure right. it out there. Stop that. Is that full? not full it should be about 11 kilograms which is the size of the tank that other guys said I just don't want to fill it and then it's not right not right right success I'm excited there's a kid watching me right now in that car there I should probably shouldn't film small random children probably not advisable <laughs> made it to our location for the night hey, and it's a sick a good one workout. our best one yet <laughs> got, oh, look, oh, you can't even tell because the it, rain's just come over but uh -huh. when we got step. here it was nice and sunny and loads of clouds have just blown over and made it look all foggy but there's mad views out we'll show you when it mad. clears again this so, is what we're doing it for, baby. <laughs> yeah, we're well excited to have our back doors backing onto a sick view for the first time. Um, oh, look at Elf looking out. Cute little pooch. So the plan of attack is we need to test the gas, but obviously the weather is not permitting such things because we need to be out under the van. We're also going to give Elf a little walk around the area just to acclimatise it to the space, but... Then it started pissing it down, so we decided against that. So we're just gonna chill for a bit. We need to have lunch actually, it's like half three. Yeah, we need some lunch. Um, yeah, so we're just gonna chill, have some lunch. And maybe when it stops raining, we'll go on a little walk because it looks like we're in a very nice area. Where actually are we, do you know? Wotton is the nearest Wotton. village. Wotton. If anyone knows where Wotton is? Near Alton in... Towers. Oh yeah, I said that before, we're near Alton Towers. There's a little, a few other little stragglers joined us. Let's see, the rain's taking the focus, but there's a few other cars. It's actually quite funny, like there's just loads of cars sat up here with people sat in the front seats just staring at the view. Just come up to watch the view. I wonder if they're having like a picnic in the car. The views chill. back, folks. Chill. No, chill. <laughs> she Go wants to just jump out. Gorge. What? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, I get what's going on, but I've never seen it before. This is what we're talking about, folks. <laughs> I just said I understand what's happening. I've just never seen it happen before. It's like you could understand the concept of something, anything, but just never have seen it. Is that not an okay observation to make? <laughs> Jeez Louise. And also it's weird that every car is doing that. Maybe a few people come up just to sit in their car and look at the view. But why has no one come up for a, for a walk? What do you think, folks? I have no one come up for a walk. I'm going to put it down to the weather. No, close. <laughs> <laughs> I used to be made in my past life. 
to go on hikes in the pouring rain. Hike people that hike don't care about the weather. What about people that just like a casual walk with you? Well, yeah, they're different people. But what I'm saying is, where are the hikers at? Is this conversation is very argumentative. It's a Sunday. <laughs> Sunday shit, folks. It's argument day. I'm hungry. I'm Yugoslavia. <laughs> oh God. She loves the bandits. She loves it, boys. She fucking loves it. The sun came out. I'm just cooking. We took us on a quick walk <coughs> down the hill, back up the hill. And now we've come back, he's doing some writing, she's doing some, some chilling, and I'm doing some cooking. Dinner is served with a beautiful view. <laughs>